good, I'm your host Jason and welcome to my PagePilot review and tutorial. PagePilot is a platform that allows users to create AI-generated landing pages for their Shopify store in seconds. For example, I went onto PagePilot and I signed up and I then went onto AliExpress and for example, I selected this product. After going through the steps that I will be showing you, this is their sample product page. So remember, all I did was select this product and with their sample product page, you can see that they have added the details as you can see right here, which you can quickly edit by tapping on the pencil icon. And by scrolling down, you can see that they have added the product images as you can see right there. They have also created a good looking add to cart. You can also see the little icons right here. And by scrolling down, you can see how their product page looks. You can see that they have also added reviews and so much more. And by scrolling up, if I were to tap on Facebook ads creative, you can see some sample Facebook ads that they have created that I can use. So you can see the different options right there. And you can also edit the length by tapping right where you see short copy. If you would like to change it to medium, you can do that. You can also tap on long copy, then tap on generate. And from there, you will create a long copy Facebook ad creative. So you can see that it is quite effective and it is also very easy to use. I will be showing you how to use it step by step. So the first thing you will need to do is go onto pagepilot.ai. Once you have done that, you're going to tap on start now for free. After tapping on start now for free, you'll be redirected to a new page. On this new page, you can quickly sign up using your email address. After you have signed up, all you'll need to do now, once you're on a page just like this, let me go back to the main dashboard. Once you're on this page, you'll tap on generate. And then from here, you can either choose to paste in your AliExpress URL or you could tap on Shopify and you could paste in a Shopify product URL. Let's say, for example, I were to go onto AliExpress once more, and I'm going to be selecting one of these products. Let's say, for example, I would like to create one for this watch. All I would need to do is simply copy the URL of the product, then go back onto PagePilot, paste in the URL right here, then from here, if you have a specific focus or angle of the product that you would like to use for copywriting, you could type it in right there. You can also select the language, then you will tap on generate. After you have tapped on generate, you're going to give it a few seconds while it creates your product page. And you can see right there, page layout, copyright, and also Facebook ads creative. So just give it a few seconds you can see they are being created. Once they have been created, you'll be able to view it. And if you decide to use it, all you'll need to do, you can go onto their paid plan and you'll get full access to it. So you can see how it looks at the moment. Remember, this is the product that I have selected and you can see how the sample product page looks. So by scrolling down, you can see it there and you can also see how it looks here. And it does look very professional, as you can see right there. And if it is a case that you'd like to edit any section, all you'll need to do is tap on the pencil icon. Then from there, you can make your changes. So you can tap here and you could change that if you want. You can change basically any section quite easily. So you can see right here, I could tap here to change that also. And if I would like to view their Facebook ad creatives once more, I can tap on Facebook Ads Creative and from here you can view how it looks. So you can see right there. Now, if I wanted to connect this to my Shopify store, I would tap on Connect Shopify. After you have tapped on Connect Shopify, all you'll need to do now is paste in your Shopify URL. So I'll go onto Shopify. And from here, all I would need to do once you're on your Shopify admin dashboard, you will simply hover over where you see online store and tap on view your online store. Then you would copy your URL. 
go back into page pilot and you're going to paste it right here after adding your store url it is now time to add your shopify key now to add the shopify key you can simply scroll down and this is how you'll be able to connect page pilot to shopify so as you can see right here the first thing you will need to do is go back onto shopify once on shopify dashboard i want you to go over to the left hand menu option and you are going to select settings in the bottom left hand corner after you have selected settings you're going to tap on app and sales channels once you have done that i want you to tap on develop apps then you're going to tap on create an app after you have done that you're going to name the app page pilot so let's do that then you're going to tap on create app after you have tapped on create app all you need to do now we can go back here and we can tap on next after doing that we'll tap on next once more and you're going to select configure admin api scopes then you'll tap on save after you have selected all four so we are going to tap on configure api scopes then from there you can see we'll need to select all so you can see select four so you can see the four that you'll selected the ones related to products and themes right there so let's go back so all you'll need to do is simply scroll down and then from there we're going to select the ones that are related to products and themes. So let's do that real quick. So you'll select these two. Then from there you'll scroll down until you see themes. You're going to select these two. Now after you have done that, you can see right there, you're going to tap on save. Now that you have tapped on save, you can go on to the next page. After going on to the next page, you can see click install app button from top right corner. So let's do that. After you have tapped on click install, you'll be redirected to that page. And from here, all you'll need to do now is copy the key. So we can copy our key right here. So we'll tap on reveal key, then we'll copy the key. After you have copied the key, you'll go back into Page Pilot AI and you're going to paste the key right here. Now, after you have pasted in the key, you'll tap on Connect Store. And after you have tapped on Connect Store, you can see right there it is now connected. Now that it has been connected, if we were to tap on Dashboard once back on this page, all we'll need to do now, we can simply select the product. Then, after selecting the product, for example, this one, I can simply tap on it then i'll see the option import in shopify i can tap on that option after you have tapped on import in shopify you can see the different options that you have when it comes on to page pilot so you'll need to upgrade your plan and choose one of their paid plans as you can see right there but that's it hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative if you did be sure to hit the like button and subscribe